hi everyone welcome back to the channel today we diving into a super useful feature which is how to set up your cloud desktop so it can read write and manage files from your computer to do that we will be using we will be using something called an mcp server and i'll explain exactly what that means in just a second so let's start with a quick overview and the tools we'll need so first what exactly is mcp mcp stands for model context protocol It's a standard that lets AI models like Claude securely connect to your local tools like your file system, calendar, or even custom apps through local servers that you control. In our case, we'll be using MCP file system server, which allows Claude to safely read and write files on your computer using only the permission you allow. So it's kind of like giving Claude a secure read-only or read-write window into your computer without handing over full access. So first, uh, let's see here. First, your first step would be to download your cloud desktop app, which you've already done. Once that's done, you're also supposed to install the Node.js app from Node.js.org. We'll be using this to run the MCP server on your machine. Once you've installed both, let's jump into the configuration. So open your terminal and run this query. Once you see a version number there, you're good to go. That means your Node.js is installed properly. Next, you're going to go to this path in our cloud directory wherever you're downloading it. As you can see, these are the folders and files we have inside our cloud folder directory. So first, we have to go to this. We have to look for our JSON file, which is our configuration file. So we're going to open this in our core editor. Okay, so as you can see, once once you inside this file, so we are going to add the JSON that tells Claude how to connect it to a file system. So now make sure you replace uh your this part with your own file path, your downloads folder, any directory you want Claude to access. So your MCP server is the key that tells Claude where to look for in the local MCP connections. The file system is just a custom label. You can name it whatever you want to call it. Command npx. This runs the server using npx, a tool that you exe that executes npm packages without needing to install them globally. And args is just used here to let uh to pass it to your npx. And dash y skips any prompts. And add context protocol file system is the actual MP MCP package we'll be using today. So yeah, here I have added my folder path, and this is how MCP. configuration should look like once this, this is done you need to restart your cloud app so i have already done that okay so once cloud looks like this you can click on this button and you can see all our mcp tools which we are will present here so as you can see we have a file system here you can click on it and see a list of tools you can use so you can turn on the ones you need like read file write file edit file you can choose whatever you need And once that's done, we can run a quick test here. So just because because my directory here is my desktop, so I'm going to run a simple query. Claude will ask us for a permission a couple of times. Once that's approved, we'll get our output. You can even do more like open a file, create one, or edit. text documents all within just the cloud desktop okay so and yeah that's it you have now connected cloud to your local file system using the mcp server this opens up powerful new ways to work with cloud securely locally and fully under your control so yeah in this tutorial if this helped you give us a like subscribe for more such videos and drop a comment if you run into any issues thank you so much